We are already starting to see some of the outer rain bands move into just you know way, way down to the, the south and east. And also what's interesting, too, is when they sent the uh, Hurricane Hunter aircraft out there, they found the center a little bit different in a little bit different spot, a little mm -hmm. bit further to the north. So it's kind of moved up the timeline just a little bit. But I mean, when it's all said and done, it just means we'll still have rain around here. It's just going to be coming in perhaps a little bit sooner. Uh, lots of clouds right now. And <clears throat> excuse me, this is what it looks like on radar. You can see a couple of those showers down there right around Atascosa County and obviously more down to the southeast and they're kind of sweeping on in here. And again, these are sort of the northern and northwestern bands and the center of circulation is down here just to the south and east of Brownsville. Uh, 60 mile per hour winds as of right now and the forecast is taking it pretty much straight to the north and then bending off to the northeast. So it's along the coast and then Houston. We're going to be sort of on the edge of everything. As as of right now with the, the current path. Now down to the uh, south and east, we do have tropical storm watches for our eastern counties, including uh, Carnes, Gonzales, Lavaca, and then tropical storm warnings down there along the coast, and also flash flood watches right there along the coast. Because looking at uh, probably four, six inches of rain, and then the heavier amounts, and also the storm surge on top of that. and. But folks in the hill country, you may not actually see any rain from this just because of the path that it is taking. We're going to be technically on the drier side of this storm. 75 degrees right now. Yeah, a whole different story than what we had Friday, Saturday morning. And the humidity, of course, is back. It did come back, as Mark was talking about, late, late Saturday night and early Sunday morning. Saturday was just a great day. Yesterday, it was pretty darn sticky out there. Mold is moderate and uh, light amounts fall elm, ragweed and pigweed. Temperature is going to be staying pretty steady this morning. We'll have a few of those showers primarily to the east and everything with the forecast today talking about rain. You just got to tag it with the word, the phrase primarily to the east. Showers and thunderstorms after school. We will see more developing just a few out to the west. The heaviest rain off to the east. How much longer will this last? What is in behind once Nicholas moves on out? Details coming up in just a couple of minutes. Steph.